Okay, hello everyone, this is Mr. Valbarona and here again, and today I'm playing online in my hero, I mean, crap, Demon Slayer Hinokami Chronicles. Once again, after about three months of not playing, I finished my holiday, and I'm back. And I just recorded a whole video talking about how I feel about this game, like, where it's at and where it's going in the future. And I think at the moment this game is kind of just my, um, it's gonna be a game that I just play for fun. Not too serious, it, like... I don't want to, like, try too hard at this game because it's a game that's kind of been left in the dust. It's a little bit bland and I don't really want to consider it a competitive game for my own well-being because I don't think it's, unfortunately, that sort of game. But one thing it is, is it's certainly fun, so I will continue to play it. Oh, I thought that was going to reset. Oh, crap! <clears throat> and one of the most char fun characters in my memory from, I guess, a few months ago <laughs> was Daki. She is such a fun character to play, and I think he's gonna break out of this. Oh, yeah, nice. <laughs> oh, perfect. Just what I wanted for the first match. Daki's hella fun, and this game in general is fun. It has a few flaws, like there was, you know, a little bit of lack of love and support from the developers, but as it currently stands, it's just a fun game to goof around and use some fun characters from a fun anime. I don't know what this reset was, but it worked. <laughs> oh, poor guy. He's probably never fought a Daki before. Oh my god, Daki resets after three months? Okay. I did just play a few matches, I won't lie. These are not my first games after three months. I did just play, I think, like two online sets before this. Because I didn't want to like embarrass myself and like forget what the dash button was. So those are my learning sets, and these are these are the real ones for sheep stations. Because as I just said, I take this game very very seriously now. Oh, also something else that has changed over these three months is I actually watched the Entertainment District season of Demon Slayer. Even though I was using all these characters and pretending to know who they are, I actually had not watched <laughs> the second season of the anime and was just going along with it. I kind of recognized the characters and like knew what they're about from what I've heard, but yeah, now I've actually watched it and honestly my opinions are it was not too stellar of a season. Like Tanjiro kind of went from a character that I really loved as main character, which is pretty rare. I usually am not a fan of main characters because of how bland they are. But Tanjiro felt different in the first season. He was, just felt like a really natural character that reacted to things in a real way. And he was just, you know, a good guy, always trying to do things. But he kind of reacted to things. Like when, the only time that he's like, starts to go like crazy and unhinged and like super, super intense mode is when like Nezuko was like strung up by Ruri. And that's when we had the awesome, like, you know, episode nine song. I'm sure you guys all remember when you were there just searching episode nine song and listening to it. But then in this season, I don't know, they just, they kind of like use that epic song over and over again after they've like made one good song. And then Tanjiro kind of like every scene, like he sees a demon and then he's like, I must protect everyone. I must protect my family. Even though like, it, it's not that intense, bro. Like you just, you just saw a demon. Like he just met Daki and he's like, oh, I can smell she's evil. So I must fight for my life, like it, and then it plays the music, like, come on, it's episode two, or like episode three, you can't be, you can't be busting out all these epic badass stops right now, and also it feels like he thinks he's a Hashiro right now, like when Gyutaro comes out, and then he just jumps in front of Tengen, an actual Hashira, like, don't do all that, bro, what, who do you think you are, you're just a guy, like, react to things normally, like you used to, I don't know, and also, like, Daki, I was like super wrong about how she was from my impression of her in the game. She's so much less cool in the anime, I don't know. She was just like super lackluster. She was just, I don't know. Like not particularly strong and also not too interesting of like a character. She just kind of exists as like, well I guess, you know, of course she kind of exists as like to make Yutaro a better character. But I don't know, I'm not a big fan of that. I think she should be really cool on her own and not just be super annoying. But 
speaking of, is that another flawless round one? Daki may not have been my favorite character in the anime, but in this game, damn, she is fun. I love my big button ladies. Oh god, I can't even say that ironically, but that's, that's too... That sounds awful. Oh, okay, okay, oh, I couldn't dash out of time. In time? I forgot how much damage this guy does. Oh no! How'd he pull out? Oh god, I've lost everything, got a boost. And get some life back, okay. Did you do that? That was not a reaction. That's just my predictions. I guess I smelt he was gonna grab or something. Come at me. Oh god, don't come at me. I didn't realize my god was still red after all this time. What the hell? <laughs> okay, well, you can have that round. I'm gonna think of using my... <laughs> I'm kind of like freelan freelancing? Just being pretty random with my Daki resets at the moment. I'm kind of just doing random stuff and hoping that it is actually good pressure. Like he's gonna block here. Oh, he didn't block. Wait, why did that combo? I'm like, I don't know what that was. Oh, I know what this is though. Oh my goodness, this combo is so long. What the? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't expect the blue combo to keep lasting for so long. Oh, I'm kind of out of everything, huh? I don't think I'll bother boosting, though. All I need to hit him is with, like, one thing. And now I've got two meters, so I can do this safely. la di da -doo. Instantly win. I must say, it was pretty cool, though, going from playing the game first and then into the anime. Like, when you've, like, really recognize all these moves that the characters do. Oh, I couldn't sidestep that in time. But then you see them, like, what they gather them from in the anime. Like, when I saw Daki do this, like, sliding attack, I was like, oh, I recognize that. It was kind of a cool experience I haven't really felt with anything else, because obviously, usually, I watch the anime first. <laughs> oh, so good. Oh, oh no. Do it again. Oh, whoa, okay. He was a lot quicker than I thought he would for covering that. Am I dead? He'll probably super and kill me, but might save it for next round, yeah. Okay. And he's gonna grab. And I'm gonna freestyle a really stupid combo. That's not gonna do much damage, but I'm gonna sidestep back and then do this. And then that didn't work. Oh my god, the stupid support killed me. Okay, that's one thing I remember. I remember every time I record a video in this game. I spend approximately 62% of the time complaining about supports and how much they annoy me. Whoa, how did I sidestep that? Hey, oh damn, my grab is really slow, huh? But I definitely don't take it back. I. I do hate supports, and I think that's also one of the things that make this game feel annoying that it's kind of dead now, because all the things that you don't like about the game, I don't really know what to do for combo here. Let's do some stuff. Oh, great combo. Nice. Come at me, please, so I can boost. Oh, he blocked it. That's scary. Oh, I didn't reach. all these little things that bug me about the game, like how supports are, like, I don't know, so annoying, how they can kill you, and like how there's that weird invincibility when you land thing, like, I don't know, a bunch of stuff that just kind of gives you the ick and makes you just that little bit more demotivated to play the game. This makes it super easy to just drop the game and forget about it. There's so many other games that, like, exist and don't have these problems that it's like, even though this is a really fun game, when you, like, have the time when you're in the mood, you're like, hmm, I want to sit down and play a game. It kind of makes this game less likely to come into your head. Because you're like, ugh, do I really want to deal with that right now? Do I want to deal with these people online that kind of have very inconsistent connections? Do I want to deal with 
like, I don't know, my combos randomly not working and raging at supports. <laughs> Or I could just play a game that I know is like really well balanced and continues to get support from the developers. Like, even though this game's got a lovely IP from an anime I love, it just becomes hard to justify playing it. And that's really sad. I'm about to die, so I'm gonna break out of that. Oh, thanks, bro. He's gonna break out of this. Oh, he didn't. No grabbing! Oh, whoa, okay, random DP, I did not expect that. Okay, re Riazanero. Oh, reason zero. Oh, damn, I keep accidentally doing two side steps when I try to do things. Because of the input delay, and you know, I just, I just be mashing. And then it comes out too many times! And now I can't break out of this too. Oh no. Oh, combo and into the boost. That was kind of cool. Excuse me. I'm pretty sure that OB Dash usually deletes support. How come he didn't get hit, stupid support? I despise my hatred for supports is eternal. You, there's no way of stopping me in every match complaining about supports. Oh, also, and something else I wanted to talk about is what games are you excited for coming out this year? There's not many, too many games like within this genre of games that I kind of cover mostly on this channel, like My Hero, Once Justice, you know, Kami Chronicles, this style of like arena fighter or like anime combat games. There's not too many coming out this year. There's oh crap. There's the, you know, the Fortnite My Hero game, which I think will be really good. It seems like it will be a lot of fun at least, but I'm just a little scared that it might be just a little bit. A little bit too much of a microtransaction farm that like will maybe irk me a little bit too the wrong way, a little bit too much. But I'm still looking forward to it. It seems like it'll be really fun. And other than that, oh, oh my god, what's going on? Also, there's the... Oh, what the heck? Why'd that come out so late? The Seven Deadly Sins game, which is, looks like a really amazing open world game which I'm super excited for, and I actually haven't even finished watching Seven Deadly Sins, I've barely watched any of it, but just because the game looks so good, I'm kind of tempted to watch it. But other than that, I'm not aware of- oh crap, I gotta break out of that. Oh crap, he can probably punish me really bad for that. I don't know what I'm doing. Why, why am I such a flop? Why would I do that? <laughs> other than that, I'm not really sure what's coming out this year. So I think this year might be my my turn from or my change from making a lot of anime combat game guides and stuff to just like having fun and playing a few anime adjacent games. There was a really cool looking game that just came out recently that people have really really loved. I've heard lots of good reviews called I think it's like Hi-Fi Rush or something and people have said like it's like the turn of the gaming industry and it's like an amazingly developed game that doesn't have all the problems that modern games have. So that sounds really fun. And it's like animated. It's, I think it's more of a Western anime. Oh crap, I need to spend all that meter on nothing. I don't think it's actual anime. There's also some other cool like um, anime style games as well that I feel like trying out, but nothing with huge IPs. I was planning on, pl I, saw, I thought that support was gonna beat me up and I was gonna be so mad. Oh, no, I meant to do the grab and not actually hit him with the dash, but whatever. Yeah, I was gonna play One Piece Odyssey, because if you don't know, One Piece is, like, actually my favorite anime ever. So, of course, I should be really into One Piece games, but unfortunately... How the hell did that hit me? Um, what I've heard from One Piece Odyssey are reviews that are less than stellar. People don't seem to think it's amazing. People think it's like good and okay. It's got good graphics. It was in development for a long time, but like nothing groundbreaking or too interesting, which is unfortunate. Cause for, what the hell is going on? Another random DP, okay. 
But yeah, I don't know. One Piece is an anime that I really love, so I get kind of um, a bit skeptical or I don't rush into playing games of it. Because I just don't want to have like a stupid game ruin my love for the anime. Because that has happened in some circumstances where like the annoyingness of the characters in the game or just I start to associate the game with um, the anime too much. And that's not good and I want to enjoy my One Piece games if it's an anime that I love deeply. I think my, the only One Piece game that I've like really super loved is One Piece Burning Blood. That was... A beautiful game. Oh crap. <laughs> that was a beautiful game. I loved it so much. How did. I don't understand supports in this game. I was dashing. At... Oh my god. <laughs> I couldn't even hit him as I woke up. But I was dashing and somehow he hit me instead of me hitting him. Stupid supports, I swear. Oh my god. And I try to sidestep and it still hits me. Oh my god. I'm so upset. Yeah, come at me. Oh, crap. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna stop rambling about random stuff and talk about the game and focus on the game. How did that even hit me? What is going on? Oh, this is the last game and I'm totally dead right now. Okay. Oh, well, this is going to be... No, too many side steps again. Crap! Oh no! I didn't think he would just throw it out like that, but thinking about it, it kind of makes sense. I should have just gone for a dash in so I can actually cancel it. Oh! thought I was doing pretty well. The first few matches I got a little too over, overconfident, over cocky. Anyways, I think we get, have time for one more match. I don't know how many of you watching, like, also make... I don't like saying making content, but like record record gameplay, make videos, make YouTube, whatever. But if if you do, surely I'm not the only one that experiences. Whenever I take a break, a break from recording things, when I come back, literally nothing works. Like my recording software doesn't work. For some reason, OBS just like crashed after two minutes of like, even without recording, it would just be sitting there and then crash after two minutes for some reason. And then my microphone settings, like for some reason just don't work and they're completely like ruined. And then my editing software, I don't know why my recording situation decides to go on a holiday when I do as well. I, I wasn't aware that software needed breaks, but apparently it does. Cause every time I come back, it's an absolute mess. <laughs> and it almost makes me want to take another break because I come back and I'm like, oh yeah, I'm finally motivated again to make some stuff, you know, I'll record this video about the games coming out next year, record a quick gameplay video for this game I haven't played in months. And then it takes me like three hours to get anything working. Like, come, that, that's not it. That's not it. Is this the same person? It's the same team, but I... It's probably the same person, isn't it? There's not that many players online. Is it right? Reason to Zero? Yeah, it is. No! Oh, damn it, the armor threw it. Ow! Come on! <laughs> Stupid support, I guess I just spend the whole game blocking or doing my kill demon skill because that actually goes through maybe I should just mash it a lot more no damn it I what is, ah, damn it I do not have this ex the execution for this game at all anymore I'm trying to do a dash like an empty dash into a grab not like dash and hit them and then grab god damn it my my pressure is a flop my, my setups are okay but my pressure is a flop okay we can do better. Let's not rely on things that I cannot execute. Oh, damn it, that hit him. Oh my god, and then I tried to attack him too late and then he messed me out. Oh my goodness. I kind of broke that combo pretty late. 
Tanjiro. Okay, I was about to say, bitch, if you hit me, I will hit you. Damn it. Okay. Damn. Yes. I didn't even need to boost. Didn't need to boost. Oh man, I'm a pro now. I go through a whole round without dying and relying on my demon regeneration factor. What a pro. Come at me. Oh. Oh. Thank god his is actually punishable, unlike mine. tried to summon his support. Poor guy. I sniped him with my obi. And then he wasted it. What a shame. Oh no, were you trying to use your support and then it didn't work? Oh no. Oh, I forgot to cancel it. Oh my god, what was that damage? Because I got hit by one random thing. Hey there, bro. Ha <laughs> oh, did you waste your support again? Oh no! And will that hit? And will that kill? Surely. I know Daki is famous for a little bit of Healing problems, but I think they should still kill, right? Nice. God, Ducky is so fun. I think she's got all the kind of tools that make me, like, really obsessed with the character. She's got, like, big buttons to play some cool footsies. She's also got, like, an interesting setup tool. She's got some cool, like, pressure setup situation stuff. Like, she's just got a little bit of everything where she's not, like, a stupid Ungabunga rushdown character, or a stupid zoner, or like an overpowered setup character. She just does a little bit of all, so like whenever you feel like doing anything, you can be like, yeah, I'll do some of that now. Come on, let's see if I can do it. Ah, oh, successful! Sorry, bro. Not that punishable. Why can't I push back? But unfortunately, you are punishable. Oh no! No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I think that OB setup is... I mean, the trap OB is more real if it's after the third hit of my attack strip. That's a grab, I know it. Okay. I'm actually not gonna spend my... Get out of my way, Tanjiro! Cool, 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 yeah. In that situation, I was about to, you know, throw out some Obi traps, or throw out some, like, demon, demon skill 1 armor stuff, but then I was like, I've got a lot of regular meter, I can just do some normal stuff and save my meter forever. I actually get hit. So I don't just die. Hey, come on! What the heck? I thought you could wake up invincibly and mash buttons in this game. Apparently, not as well as I thought you could. Tanjiro, I swear, get out of my face! Oh my god. Supports! Sorry, bro. Can't punish that. No, wrong way! Oh my god, I just spent so much meter on that. Come at me. <laughs> if anything is overpowered about Daki, that button is certainly one of them. Tilt, I mean, Demon Skill 1, come on, that move <laughs> is crazy. Oh, what 
you do Oh my god, stupid. Oh my god, I can't say anything. I'm just so flabbergasted. I thought I was so cool. I don't know what's going on this round. Um, I thought I was so cool. He was just standing there thinking he can build back his meter. I caught him with the entangling OB projectile thingy. But then I tried to combo off of it, and guess who was in front of me? Stupid ass times you roll. Don't know what's going on, but I'm dying. And lagging? Sorry, bro. Did you forget? Wait! What? I thought you couldn't punish anything with the sin. Ah! Because, no, I couldn't sidestep. No! Oh. I tried to be real, like, badass anime protagonist. No, like, ah. Did you just try? And then, no, I knew. That's not a very good impression. I'm gonna pretend that didn't happen, actually. Is this combo? Oh, sorry, bro. Okay. <laughs> I think I'm starting to lose it. See, this game, I think I can only play it like once a week, or once every two weeks. I lose my, lose my sanity and my sense of self very quickly. Okay, one more rematch. We got this. Stay calm. Stay poised. You do, you do the pressure. You do the big buttons. And you don't get mad at supports instantly. Oh, and you also make sure you cancel that. Ha ha ha. Take that stupid Tanjiro. Why didn't I cancel that again? Combo, I did the wrong thing. Come at me. <laughs> Taki has so many ways to extend, so many ways to set up. She's so cool. Boom! Oh, wow, you managed to squeeze right in between my, my slashes. And then deal half of my life for it. Thank you. <laughs> Get him! Yeah! No! He just busted so he could do that. I know none of the combos I'm doing are optimal. Don't even bother telling me it. I know. But I'm winning and I'm having fun. So what else is there? Oh god, push, push. <laughs> oh my god. She's too cool. And then I go like this. And then he runs at me. What's he doing? No! What was that? Bam! 3 0. No. Flawless. For the demon Daki, who is way cooler in the game than she is in the anime. GG's. Very much so. Thank you for playing against me, and thank you, game, for actually being able to find people for me to fight against. It was surprisingly easy. It's honestly got a better matchmaking system than Strive. But don't tell Arxis that. Ooh, my chair just broke. Oh, okay. Oh god, I need to end these videos quicker. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.